Hello, I'm Sanjeev Kohli. I'm bringing you all the red carpet action here at the BAFTA Scotland Awards 2022. I'll be honest, I put on the full kill outfit, full kill outfit, and here's Yong Chin Breslin here looking just absolutely stupendous. You look amazing. Thank you, thank you. It took me five minutes. I just did it in the taxi here. Can I can I give a name for your brand? Sexy Dalek? Um, I was thinking Space Mermaid. Space Mermaid go works for me as well. Can we discuss this? Yes. What, what is it? Where is it from? I love it. It's a peacock. And and also can we discuss the bag? <laughs> Beautiful. It's beautiful. You didn't even phone each other. It's lovely. <laughs> is that as practical, as impractical as it looks? It's almost like wearing a wetsuit. You have to like slide your way around the room, but it looks quite sleek when you do it. Is it kind of turned you into Grace Jones a wee bit? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, let's say that. Are you gonna Are you gonna punch me? <laughs> <laughs> Be careful. Maybe. But I'm loving like tartan, Harris Tweed, all of that stuff. I mean, I love how it's being marketed I now. We wanted some um, some gorgeous dreads to honour the heritage because we're not only Scottish. Yeah. There are so many things to so many people. Absolutely. Everything all at once, as they say. Everything, everything. Have you seen that film? Everything, oh everyone. It is amazing. But you're almost like the embodiment of that. Oh, stop it. You are a one woman multiverse. Oh my God. Does that sound like a line? Yeah. The vision, the vision that this shooting got was here, right? Look at, oh my God, look at you. Oh my oh, God, look at you. Thank you. Thank every you very time, much. Every time, every time. Listen, I have to do Doctor Who business. I'm sorry. I know it's your life now. Right? <laughs> okay. You've got a very strong look. You always do. You always upstage everyone in the room. <laughs> have we settled on the doctor's look yet? Is that still oh, any clues? Any clues? No clues other than pure shooting. Shooting. No, no, not pure shooting, just pure amazingness. Edith, how are you? Listen, this is uh, this is your night. You're the beating heart of uh, no, Scottish Baptist. I'm the the glue. I'm the glue between all the pieces. That's why I'm. Well, I'm getting high sniffing you. <laughs> no, that that came out all wrong. And what about you? What's caught your eye this year, would you say? Oh man, so much stuff. I mean, I've got to say, being a Pfeiffer, that Karen Perry, I was a oh, big fan of. And her. I love Lauren oh. so much. I might have brought a bum bag tonight for a comedy <laughs> gag on stage. Lauren and, and, and Chitty, I mean, you know, he's, he's been so supportive of Bath Scotland over the years. You know, he won previously and stuff. Remember him being here with his mum and his auntie. And he's back tonight. And the fact that we get to have a moment to celebrate the fact that he's the new doctor is beautiful. So listen, we're celebrating uh, 12 months of uh, Scottish film and telly. But just generally, what's what you've been watching this year? What's been filling your time? Well, actually, last night I watched Somewhere Boy, which was... I know there's Lewis is yeah. here tonight. So I'm watching that. Um, Doctor Who, of course. Um, I'm trying to think what else I've been watching. This was all just for research for tonight, was it's it? Really? Dude, I have to say, River City, they had their 20th anniversary, and that episode, I don't know. Did you go back? I didn't go back. However, I didn't have a chance, but um, Shell Suit Bob drank a bottle of blue liquid and then went on this trip where he saw these other characters. Only in Scotland can you have uh, some amazing storytelling like that. I loved that episode. It was fantastic. I mean, we're obviously here to discuss. You I mean you're getting lifetime achievement award? No, I, I, Am I old enough for that? Well, you're not. You're not. But it's one of those things. You, you when you look at someone's CV and you kind of have to give them something that's so bloody good. I ain't getting one, but you're getting one. No, no, you'll be there. I don't, no, yeah. Eventually, the year after. But like, in fact, if I wasn't going to be here, it's probably going to be you. Am I on the subspecial for Capaldi? Happily, happily. God, you're gorgeous. Hi. Hi. Uh, hi. 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 Everybody all right? Yeah?
the Scottish Bafta Award. Goes to. see them my roots are here I've never moved away I've never tried to live in London or things I just love Glasgow I love the city I love the people and it's my home so to have like awards at your home and it is you meet your friends but it's also just celebrating all this amazing talent that we have in our country and it's just lovely being here. It does seem to be a particularly vintage year, doesn't it? There's so much, and it's it's so exciting when you hear, like, you know, in my kind of sort of pre-awards gamble, it's, there's a few facts and figures in there in terms of, like, how much money and stuff, and you're like, this is exciting. And it's that whole thing that BAFTA does as well, that behind the scenes that people don't see, this all the glitz and glamour of it, but all these new generations of people, they're helping train up so that that can continue. That's what's exciting as well. Yeah. It says up there, it's great to be here. Well, of course it's bloody great to be here. It's my home. What a beautiful reception. It is always such an honour coming back to Bath to Scotland, the best night of the year. Scotland and Glasgow. Every little thing we do, we do it for you, Glasgow. I am so proud to be Scottish, and I am so proud to be a Scottish brown woman as well. We're not doing too bad, Henny! <laughs> we in this room, we have no cause without these cinemas. We have no cause. The stories that we choose to tell and the issues that we choose to give voice to, they remain untold and unheard without independent cinemas. I, I want to say thank you so much to everyone who's been nominated tonight. What an amazing celebration of Scottish film and TV. Honestly, so much talent here. So congratulations to all the nominees, all the winners. I'm extremely delighted to present the 2022 BAFTA Scotland Award for outstanding contribution to film and television. And this year it goes to Peter Capaldi. Outstanding contribution to film and TV, I don't know. I think this is really an award for uh, getting lucky. For being lucky enough to be born in Scotland, into a family of immigrants from Ireland and Italy. <laughs> lucky enough to meet so many people along the way who changed my life. I've been Edith Foreman. I'm pretty sure this has been Bath to Scotland. It's so great to be back in the room with you all. Please, please, can we do it again next year? Yeah? Have a great night, everybody. Thank you.